Hello everyone, this is Anuj from Gadget Keg. Yesterday Google revealed the Android O in a live event online and it's called Android Oreo. And today in this video, we will talk about how to install it on the supported device if you haven't received the OTA update. So let's start. Do not forget to press the bell icon next to the subscribe button to get the notification from Gadget Gig and stay updated and informed. Android 8.0 is finally here and Google named it Android Oreo. Few months back we did our first video on Android O. Like many others, we also thought it will be called Android Oreo. So do you like the name of Android O or you were expecting something else? Let me know in the comment section below. Now about the Android O, it's available right now to download for Nexus and Pixel devices. And after a couple of months, we might see the update coming to other phones. So if you have a Nexus or Pixel device and wants to install it right now and didn't get the OTA update like us then follow the steps shown in this video and as always back up your device data before proceeding further So first go to the link developer.android.com and download the system image file for your device I have all the links in the description below After that download the platform tools here I will be using Mac so I will be downloading the platform tools for Mac Now extract both the folders which you have downloaded. Once done, copy the platform tool content in the firmware folder. After that, you need to put your phone in fast boot mode. For Nexus 6P, we have to press and hold the volume up and power button. Now once we are in the fast boot mode we need to unlock the bootloader unlocking and locking the bootloader will remove all your data so make sure again that you have a backup of your phone first open terminal then go to the directory where you have the firmware folder for example for us it's on the desktop so cd space desktop after that type in the name of the folder cd space android o so to unlock the bootloader type in the command fast boot flashing unlock or if you're using mac like me then type the command dot forward slash fast boot flashing unlock If you have already boot locker unlocked you will get a message that the bootloader is already unlocked I have all the steps in the description below so do check out them if you are confused After unlocking the bootloader for Windows it's really simple all you need to do is double click the flash hyphen all dot bat file and it will install the android oreo and if you're on mac then we have to do few things manually we will flash the bootloader and the radio file for that type in the command dot forward slash fast boot flash bootloader and drag the bootloader file in the terminal window and then press enter you have to do the same thing for the radio And then we need to reboot by typing dot forward slash fast boot space reboot space bootloader. Once it's rebooted, you need to type in the command dot forward slash fast boot space hyphen w space update, and then drag the zip file you see in the folder. It will complete, and then press enter. After pressing enter it will start installing the Android Oreo. After 5-10 minutes you will be on the Android setup screen. We have done the what's new video in Android O in past and there is not much change since then. You can check the video link in the description below. Some of the features which Google says doesn't work for us in the Nexus 6P. like picture in picture and new notification dot is not available but overall the performance is really good as i was using the developer preview before and most of the changes are under the hood so that's it guys this was the guide to update your nexus and pixel device to android oreo let us know if you have any questions or issues in the comment section below and we will try to answer as soon as possible And if you like this video please press the like button and subscribe to our channel Gadget Geek for more videos like this. Once again this is Anuj signing off and I'll see you in the next one.